The U.S. has released a set of declassified satellite images, which it says show that the Syrian government has launched a campaign of repression against the Syrian people. In at least one of the images, you can see heavy artillery. However, you cannot see any property damage or perhaps more important, any human carnage that might have resulted from any of the weapons being used. A top aide to Secretary of State Hillary Clinton says that the release of these satellite images is just one more way in which the U.S. is holding Syria accountable for its actions. These are the facts on the ground. And the more that we are able to get video imagery and photographs and other testimonials out of Syria and show them to the world, the more difficult it is for the Syrian regime to try to deny what is happening or for the allies of the Syrian regime around the world to deny what is happening. Now the U.S. is still talking with the Arab League, with the EU and with other allies on a possible humanitarian mission to help the Syrian people. And officials admit that after last weekend's double veto at the U.N. Security Council, they have been forced to look for other diplomatic means of trying to resolve the crisis.